Overfishing in Queensland. What is being done to reduce overfishing in our waters? Who is responsible for overfishing? What effect is it having on our ecosystem? These are all topics that scientists and marine biologists have been researching and with the assistance of the community, through surveys and governing bodies, they are developing ways to reduce this issue. What is the issue? Studies have shown that all species of fish that Australians know today will cease to exist by 2048. Overfishing is caused by commercial and recreational fishing with certain species of fish being so overexploited that some fish populations cannot be sustained. Australian waterways are being overfished and are at a point where fish stocks are either overexploited or depleted. The pyroplankton are at the start of the food web and help plants and algae to grow and produce our main oxygen supply. Continuing to overfish waterways will reduce the oxygen supply for humans, plants and animal species. It has been found that some commercial fisheries have had to increase their efforts to catch something of commercial value. Therefore, mammals, sharks, seabirds and other viable fish stocks are being caught in nets and are being thrown away as bycatch, with alarming results showing that some fisheries are throwing away up to 80% of the catch as bycatch and is being discarded. Why is overfishing an issue? The environment relies heavily on a sustainable marine ecosystem. Statistics have stated that 52% of fish stocks are fully exploited, 20% are moderately exploited, 17% are overexploited, 7% are depleted, and 1% is recovering from depletion. Contributing factors why overfishing is still an issue. Technology has played a big part in depleting species and in some cases, depleted and so overexploited these species they are facing extinction. Spotter planes, helicopters, sonar and satellite images are being used to fish. Sonars are so readily available and are cheap to buy it is making it easy for commercial and recreational fishing boats to be able to access these devices. This type of fishing is having a significant impact on many species of fish. Here is an example of some devices available. What is being done to reduce the problem? A holistic approach is needed to ensure that a solution can be found for this issue. Overfishing is a global issue, therefore it requires governing bodies that can enforce laws to help conserve marine life and ensure people are upholding laws. Overfishing has occurred for many years and it will take time to ensure the oceans return to be healthy and productive once again. The Agricultural and Fisheries Department Work to help increase industry productivity and profitability while protecting Queensland's valuable resources. The Agriculture and Fisheries Department have a basic management method which is in place to conserve fisheries, habitats and resources to current and future generations. They collect social, attitudinal and motivational survey reports from local fisheries that have spent over a 10 year period but found a change in the attitudes of fishers. From the research I have conducted, it has allowed for stricter laws to be enforced. Conservation projects have developed and they have over 100 conservation projects supporting breeding programs of freshwater fish in dams and other waterways. Why is the ocean important? Fish are a valuable food source many depend on for social, economic and dietary reasons. Many large species of fish are on the endangered list and play an important role in maintaining a healthy ecosystem. We need to look after our oceans to ensure a sustainable ocean for future generations.